guys and welcome back to my channel i hope you are well who wants to go on a autumn winter shopping trip with me hopefully you which is why you're watching this video i am so excited today i thought it'd be super fun to head over to birmingham it's a very rainy day it's giving autumn i thought it'd be so cute to go over and see what all is new in the shop so we can go into zara primark h&m have a little look around selfridges i also am going to need some sort of breakfast when we get there because i've just come from a nail appointment but i thought it'd be fun to go on a little shopping trip together see what's new in the shops see what we're obsessed with maybe start putting some things on our christmas list so i will see you guys there okay right we're here we made it the traffic actually was not bad at all but we just pop i've just popped for all me and now i thought we could go to zara first i feel like i'm most excited for that i feel like this is where zara truly thrives so let's go to zara also there's been like a new i think it's jd shop open in the ball ring i saw it on tiktok on china mooney's store and um, china mooney's tiktok the other day so I'd like to see it. I know there's a new foot asylum as well, and there's also a new Marks and Spencers. And the Marks and Spencers, I'm sorry, looks so cute and bougie. Look at this MS. This looks so good. Oh, look, they've got like a way here fruit and veg section. It's huge. Guys, look at the MS basket. That's so cute. Such a cute store. This is the big JD. Like, it's huge. If you guys have been to the boring club. It's like all shops were, but it's very late, it's not really giving my vibe, so let's go to Zara. Oh guys, I literally just walked in and spotted this. How nice, it's so thick. It's £46, which I actually think it's probably worth it for how thick this is and oversized. Like, this is a small, and honestly, with jeans and Uggs, this is gorge. Oh my god, that dress is beautiful. Imagine for New Year's Eve. Also, this is nice, this actually feels so soft. Wow, that's expensive for New Zara. Nice for like a wedding um, guest dress or something. But this is beautiful. If you've got a fancy birthday or a New Year's Eve party or something, this is so nice. It'd also be nice with like a big like shawl over like a fluffy coat or something. This is 120. What beautiful. Oh, I've not seen this. Wow, it's like a Borg denim. £90. That looks so cute. Maybe we should try that on, grab one and take it upstairs to try on. That's so cute. I've not seen that before. I also love both of these. This is a chocolate cardigan. This is £10 cheaper than the other one. It's 35 And then I also love this Borg, just like teddy bear coat. £70, but it feels so thick and oversized that you could literally wear this a hundred different ways. Okay, we are upstairs. The vibes are normally a little bit better up here. This looks really good for £60. I'm not 100% on the colour. But I love it. It's very party. Like there's a lot of these like slip dresses, and it's cool with that little detail. Just like this jumper, and it looks really cute. I think I'm gonna grab a medium to try on. Looks like this. I love the detail of the knit. Not me still being obsessed with this top, but having literally nowhere to wear it to. I just love it. I think it's so cool. It's like a khaki utility top. It's thirty pound, but I just love it. But I just know I'll buy it and have literally nowhere to wear it. That is such a cool tracksuit. I feel like the wide legs are like too wide for me. But I love that. It's very like sis and seek is very cool girl. This dress is such a gorgeous material. It's 35 paint. I've also just seen it in like a charcoal, but it's a full length dress with this ruched detail. And I just love like the neckline of it and everything. I think it looks so classy. So such a cute jumper. And I've also got it in blue, but I think I really like the cream. Zara really said, let's just do this material in every single style. Like I've seen so many variations of this now. They really said copy and paste. Guys, if I have not influenced you to buy these, sorry about doing the camera in, then honestly take this as your sign. These are the most comfortable flattering t-shirts that Zara have ever done. I've got the white one and they're gorgeous it's actually 59 it's a very like skims-esque top but they've also now got a chocolate they've got black as well they've normally got like a mauve and a olive but the chocolate's so cute okay who's ready for a classic try on session in zara i've got four things really cute things i thought we could try them on see how they actually look because things always look cute off the hanger in here but it's all about how they actually fit and make us feel so let's try them on okay we do not have the age on for this but what do we think i've seen so many girls in this i've seen it in here a few times 
I do love that the zip is so chunky, like it does feel expensive, as it should because it's £60. This is a small, extra small to small. I don't know if I'd want a medium to wear it with leggings because it is like, you know, and it's just a little bit short, but I didn't think that this would actually give you that like, mm, it's worth £60 feel. I actually know it's on. I'm like, low-key feel like it is worth £60, but I feel like I would want the medium just for length more so like I love the boxiness I feel like it's one of those things that you'd buy and never have to repurchase just one you know like it just lasts you for so long and I love that it's got pockets and it's that like sweatshirt slash knitwear which I really love but I feel like it would be nice to have bigger to wear with like chunky boots and like a black bag so those are my thoughts on that but I actually like it way more than I was expecting okay the real thoughts on this are I think it's cute I don't think it would become like your everyday winter jacket just because it's like dead and it's light denim and I feel like it doesn't feel winter. It's definitely more like transitional, like I feel like I'd wear this more in February, March. I don't think that it's like it looks the best, like quality wise. It feels nice, I love that it's fur inside, but I actually think this drains me, like for a medium I think I'd want much more, you know, and it's just so hangy, like it's definitely very oversized, so I would say stay true to size with this, don't size it, but cute, but don't think I'm like obsessed, you will need this for winter. Really simple Okay, thoughts on the jumper. I actually thought this would feel way thicker. I feel like it looks really thick because of the texture of it and like on the arms, but it actually feels quite, I don't know, not measly, but like it doesn't feel like anything crazy. You would definitely need to wear like a long sleeve to on underneath this to feel warm. It's a cute colour for sure. Like I love the buttercream there. But I would say again, like the sizing seems a bit odd. Like I think I'd want this in like an extra large just to. I don't know, have that like bagginess of the knit. The arms are nice, but like this bit I find like, I don't know. It's just not giving me whack. Lol, not that black dress that I picked up actually, like it was just not a good time. It didn't zip up, it just looked awful. Like self-confidence is pretty much on the floor. So we are going into Primark. I came into Primark last week, I think it was, and it was actually really good. Like they had a lot of cute things, so I am looking forward to having a little break and I know that Rita Aurora's got more stuff out like that girl cannot stop so have a little look at that have a little look at the Christmas PJs honestly being a girl it's just so fun like the fact that this is our thing it's just gorge talking of gorge look at this coat only £50 which I know is expensive for Primark but this on PLT would be like 80 doesn't feel the thickest, but I love that it's borg inside. I just love the suede with the borg detail, it's so cute. And they've also got a black trench, which is giving Kai, which is really cute. This is 40. Oh my god, guys, look at these earmuffs. Five pound. Oh my god, I want these in cream. I love how fluffy the. Oh wait, one of them's broke. I was so confused then, he's broken off. But oh my god, I've never seen those. Look at all the fluffy headbands and the hats. I'm obsessed. Imagine how warm you would be on that in a snowy day. I've also seen so many people going crazy about this coat. Apparently it's like a, a dupe of the Zara one. I would like to try it on because I really want a fur coat. I feel like they always just, like they're classic. You'll never get bored of them. They go with so much. Okay, right. They've either got small or extra large. Should we try the extra large on? Okay, yeah. I actually think this looks so expensive. I can see. I think it was. Is it Romy Morris? R O M Y. I'm sure it's Romy Morris. I saw it on her Instagram story. I think it was saying like, "Don't bother about my Zara one. Like this is at half the price." You know what? It's actually so cute. Like you know, you just put this on and feel like rich. It's giving rich mom. I just love these fur jackets so much. I feel like you can like, really dress them down with literally like leggings and trainers and then wear it super fancy to like a dinner. I don't know how much this one was, but honestly, big slay from Rita Aurora coming through with the goods as always. Okay, for reference, that was 40 pounds because I just checked, but I just saw this bag. And this just gives me like mango. Again, very put together item. Like, I wonder if I could fit my Mac in that. It's 14 pounds, but I love it. I've seen this in black before, but the nude, is so cute, like I feel like that go with so much of my outfits. Honestly, run, don't walk to Primark for these jumpers. They're like a bouquet, they're so soft. I picked up this pale pink a few weeks ago and honestly, I got so many compliments on it. It looks so expensive, it's literally like £12. 
Hmm, interesting. I thought it was 12. Maybe they were. Okay, maybe they were 15. But honestly, so nice. Like, they're so soft. I got it oversized, but I also love this buttercream colour. I think it looks good. It's honestly one of the nicest jumpers I've got. They've got so many jumpers. I also really like this knit, and I like the dusky pink colour. Going up to the next floor. Okay, this is giving very much like party, like if you've got work by, I feel like these could be styled so nice. These are only £18, I think that's so good. I wish they were a little bit more of a flare, they have got a slight flare to them, but I love the nude and silver sequin, I think it looks so cute. But it's very, very like Christmas party. Party season is officially here, babes. £20 for this sparkle dress. Also they've got, instead of the trousers, they've got it in a dress, that's 22 and they've also got the trousers That's in black. Cute. And they've got more fur jackets. We love that. £40 again. I think this is the same, just a black version. Why do I want to come here? Honestly, it smells so good. They've got all like Grinchmas. It's like the Grinch cat basically. And they've got all different drinks and hot chocolates and shakes. And honestly, it all looks so good. I just want all of it. Anyone else love Primark jewellery? Look at these. These are two pounds. I feel like these are so cute for like jingle baskets or stocking fillers. Little like got they've got silver as well. They've also got silver with like little diamonds. They're literally two pounds. Like I would love these in my seconds or get like your boyfriend's name, like initial. Oh, they've got gold. Look how cute. Gold sparkles. I've also got these like teardrop ones which are really cute. I feel like those those would look nice, you know, like for a Christmas meal. And then these, honestly, £3.50 you get six pairs every day, every occasion. Like firsts, seconds, thirds, first, seconds, thirds, so many different ones. I also love these hearts, how cute. And of course, Rita Aurora is always slaying all over the shop, so she's also got some jewellery too. I love these really cute i also like these but i thought those are just too big for me oh wow classics i had some very similar to, the, to them which i really loved just having a little braids at the underwear but i thought i'd give you an ootd this set is actually boohoo and it, they, it sells separately but if it's still in stock i got it a couple months ago now at the start of autumn so i just knew i'd wear it so much i feel like you just look so put together in a knitted co ward so if it's still available i'll drop the link below this bag is from Primark. £10 honestly has been my bag of the season. Hoops are also boohoo. And then I've got my anti leg bugs. Ultra minutes. But I'm just going to have a look at the pyjamas too, see if there's any that I am super obsessed with. Wow, guys, if you are a nightshirt type of girl, you need to come to Primark to get this. Look how stretchy. I can't explain how soft and stretchy and thick but light these are there's two colors there's a pink and then there's more of a blue also really cute if you're like going into hospital to have a baby 12 pound you know if you was having a girl or a boy but they're 12 pound but honestly incredibly soft like wow okay we are in h and um, so far it's just giving very party again which is where i feel like the shops seem to lose me because it's like where's just the, like the cozy snuggly autumn winter vibes when it's all like party season that's where i'm like not much of a party girl but I did see this jumper and i think this is actually quite cute you know if you've got like a christmas jumper day at work or at school and you don't want to be like in your face i quite like this monochrome one it's 33 pound i feel like with black leggings crossbody black bags some chunky boots you can actually make this look quite cool and then like, i love the sleeve detail oh my god i actually really like this yellow jumper i feel like it's not what we typically wear at this time of year but i really like it i'm gonna try and find it I also think this is so cute, especially if you've got a trip to Paris coming up and it's got like the slightly oversized sleeve. Oh, it's here, guys. This is so cute. It's £25, that's not so bad. It's got like a white pattern on the front and then it's just plain on the back, but it's nice and like thick jumper actually. It's not super soft, but it's super thick. Oh my god, adds to Christmas list immediately. I need to go skiing. I'm sorry. I need to go. Like, I need to experience it. These are £43. They're like moon boot dupes. I, th I looked. Moon boots, I think, are about £150. So, I mean, I obviously don't know quality comparison. I've never had moon boots. But for, like, cuteness and outfit-wise, I love them. They've got a, like, cream and it's almost like an olive -y beige. And then they've also got a black pair. But they look so cool. Like, 
I would even just wear these in normal day to day life, like when it gets really cold. Oh my god, what a cute hat. Oh, it's Borg fur lined. I also love these, I've seen these a few times. I feel though, like I've seen a lot of these in Primark as well. Like, who's wearing them at this time of year? Your toes are surely away. Like, it's so cold for the little piggies. I think this jumper actually wins the award for cutest jumper fame today. This is so thick and soft. It's £45. I love it. It's like an icy, like, ashy white. This is actually so cute. I love it. It's so thick. Like, I wish you guys could feel this through the screen. Honestly, like, incredible. I just popped into H&M home because it just called me in. And, you know, why could you, like, literally take out a mortgage just to buy everything from H&M home? Because it's all so cute. And look at this Christmas setup we've got. Mm -hmm. No, I just want my future house to look on Christmas Day. Like, I'm obsessed. And I love these little napkin thing rings. I also love this mug. Let's just take your time. How nice the package is. How classic. That is mm, 9 99 I think that's actually quite good. And they've also got a green diffuser. How nice. No, it smells incredible. That one actually smells nicer than the candle. Wow. Obsessed. The Christmas market being up makes me so happy. I could honestly, I just need to come on a date here now. Like, I could just walk along all of these stalls. Look at all the little cookies. I love it. Oh, I want to get old one. Guys, it gets so cute. If you've never been to Birmingham Christmas Market, it goes all the way up to the top and then like there's a bit of a square and it sort of breaks off into the square, but at night it's always so pretty. Come to my favourite place for lunch. Can I get leaves, please? Yeah, could I please get um, red onion? Um, could I get cucumber? Can I get roast potatoes? Peppers and big treat, please. Actually, the best salad I've ever had. I just expect to bring that man's selfie, bless him. I, right, so what I got was a regular salad bowl from Philpot. If you don't know about Philpot, you clearly don't watch me and Mia enough because we just discovered it one day. Not the one I've just been to, the one a little bit further up by, like Holmwell Road. We just discovered it one day when we were doing a content day I think and we've never looked back like the temptation to just get like something small from the German market it was there to be honest but then I was like you know what I'm going to enjoy this salad so much more like you've never had anything like it you pick all the salad and then they put it in like a bowl and they mix it like a big mixing bowl like honestly like the size of like God knows what, and they mix it all up and it's just to die for so that's what I got. So I'm just going to walk back to the car now. I was going to have a little look around selfies, but to be honest, I feel like it's going to be the same old as usual and I am starving. So off we go with the only purchase of the day. Okay, right. We are back in the car and I thought I'd give you a little peek at my salad. Because you guys need to try this. Like, honestly, if you... I don't know if they're, like, everywhere. I feel like they are. I don't feel like it's just a Birmingham thing. But... It's not normally got cling film on, by the way. It's just she put so much in. She was like, I'm going to put cling film over it so it doesn't leak. I was like, thank you so much. So I get mixed leaves as my base. Then for my protein, I get chicken and avocado. And it's in like a mayonnaise sauce. And then, look how good. Mm, don't even talk to me. Bloody incredible. And then on that, I get beetroot, red pepper, roast potatoes, which are these. They're so crispy red onion did i say beetroot cucumber you get five i don't know whether i've said five but that's what i get and then a little bit of mayonnaise because there's already mayonnaise on the on the chicken you don't need like a lot but i'm just gonna get a little photo for my insta however i don't know whether i'm gonna be able to sit and eat this because i've paid for my parking and i don't know like how long you get in between paying your parking and having to leave you know like they're not going to let you pay and then leave like an hour later. So, I'm going to have a few mouthfuls and then get out of here. But it's so good. Mm. Right, I'm going to leave that until I get home. But I hope you guys really enjoyed this video. I love filming these come shops so much. So, if you want to see more of these on the channel, then drop me a comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel. It would mean so very much. I love you so much. I hope I haven't got. 
my nose on me i love you all so very much honestly you make like my days so much brighter so i'm sending you all the love in the world thank you for shopping and watching and coming with me and i will see you on thursday with a brand new video goodbye